Jamie, you also have a, an incredibly emotional scene with Christopher Walken um, toward toward the end of his day his days, and and I I thought that was just such a such a lovely I mean obviously beautifully written um, but also acted uh, scene. Tell me about that day. Um, Shanley will testify to this. I I I, um, I cried all day. I couldn't stop crying that day. I uh, truly was just so moved every time Chris released those words the way he did, you know, and we, we, it, we had uh, the whole uh, second half of the day to shoot it. And um, we started with Chris's coverage and he wanted to get that out of the way and he was just so beautiful. And then, you know, a few different angles and, you know, coverage of the star out the window, I was crying, coverage of the ashtray, I was crying. And then they finally, ah. <laughs> finally got onto my coverage and I was, I was wrecked. I was just wrecked. And actually, I remember I had that wee room, like the, the go to, like a little bedroom in the in the in the farmhouse to go to in between. And I would I'd cry on set, listening to the words. And then I'd actually just go and sit in that room, and I'd cry. I honestly, I would sit in that room by myself, and I would cry. And I'd be like, "Jimmy, you ready for you?" And I'm like, oh, yeah. "And I'd, I'd go back out." And then it finally got around to my coverage, and I did an interview with a, a friend of mine, who's an actress who uh, interviewed me for something recently for this and she watched the movie and I was talking to her about that and she said yeah because on your coverage you just look so like ruddy and swollen and red and terrible <laughs> and I was like yeah that's great yeah I do yeah I've been crying all day by that point um but Chris was just breaking my heart you know and that was Chris's last day of the shoot as well so there's a element of that uh, playing into it and uh you know, we all just fell in love with Chris Walken and it's one of the joys of my life to, to be able to say that, you know, I played his son in something.